Hey folks, I'm HP and this is Dr. Pink and today's topic is <coughs> Hell <laughs> One of the all-time favorites of mine of Black Sabbath uh, The Late Ones But I always thought that's the best song they ever had and um, believe it or not when I was younger I had these um, leather jacket and the batches with you know all that stuff and this uh, you know what i mean <laughs> i was a huge fan so let's do evident <laughs> let's be very evil <laughs> i first gotta play for you now that you know what i'm talking about i create a backing track I created a backing track uh, for this tutorial, so the singing parts are only short, um, but uh, basically there you don't play. <laughs> so if you want to practice, practice my backing track, or you can practice with the original one I took, the one from uh, Life in the Royal Albert Hall, really awesome version of it. And um, let's get started now. It's pretty easy, just a few parts you need to know, and then let it rock. Wow. <laughs> Let's get started with the first riff. That's the main riff, and uh, it's played by Tommy Yoni, or as it's called, with his rubber fingers. And um, I checked it out, and he plays it this way. <laughs> the hard way, <laughs> but he really plays it that way. So he's playing power chords uh, with the root on the A string. So, D5, 5th, 7th, then move up, I'm just gonna name the fret, just move up this chord, so 3, 5, 7, 8, 1, 3, 5, 7, 8, and now comes the hard part, that you can move down, just move down, 10, 8, 7, 1. And the rhythm is like this. That's how it's played. And with your damping hand, you just, when you move them, you have to do all down strokes. That's a little bit tricky, so. So let's give it a shot. Two, three, boom. Twice. So you play that part twice and you end up, and this one is a little bit tricky. In between you have to damp with your damping hand. You move down with the hand, see, and that's it. So well twice on the, you end up with D5 and this one here. Third fret, second fret, open A and open D string. 
And if you're standing in a big, big hall with a lot of martial ampli amplification behind you, you get the feedbacks here and just let ring this chord. Maybe I get it too. No. <laughs> yeah, so this is the first part. It then goes in a kind of a, of a refrain. Let's go there now. D uh, B5, B flat 5, first fret, still the same chord as before. Then C5, and then comes the riff. So you play a single note line here. Fifth fret, second, third. See? You damp. Then you jump up here in the tenth fret and make a double stop on the D and G string. And second phrase. That's the second phrase. And that is placed twice and you end up again with with this D5 which you let ring. So let's play that part now. So that's the second part. If you want to make it a little bit more red and a little bit more rocky and a little bit more heavy and helly, try to add some hormone pinch harmonics here. That would be awesome. Yeah. Good. Then comes lyrics again. Uh, sorry, I forgot them. Then comes a part which sounds like this. Uh, So that was this part. Uh, basically, the new thing which came was this here. You play a D minor, 7th, 7th, 6th fret here, and C. Here in the 5th, bar over the, f over, uh, the uh, blah, 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 D, G, and B string. Played a few times, and then comes the uh, refrain again, but only half of it, this one here. That comes three times. Then comes the, in the entering lick again, riff again. Yeah, and then comes the very last part that took me so while to find out the proper chords. It's this one here. So, so that's the last part, and then I just need to learn the form a little bit. So that was 
the last part is a little bit tricky. Starts with the G minor here, third fret. A little bit only slightly distorted. You can do this with the volume uh, pedal or whatever. G minor, bar in the third here, ring finger pinky in the fifth on the A and D to C. Now comes a E flat with the F in the bass. <laughs> How's that done? You don't have to play the bass because the bass plays it, so you only play E flat. So here fourth fret, third fret, and here fifth fret. See? Two. Um, B flat with the F in the bass. Also, again, you don't have to play the bass, you just play this. Here, third, third, third fret. Then comes a F with a C in the bass. Again, you don't need to play the bass. You just play F here. Sixth fret, fifth fret, seventh fret. C. Five, five, five. And end up with a G major chord. You can do this one here. Third fret. A string is down, play till the B string. Yeah, and that's this part. That's really, I like that one, it's very nice. Play it again. So on. Good. And now let's play the whole song and I'm going to add the delay now to make it more wild. The delay is set on, on the quarter note of the song. And um, these were all parts. Now the next thing will be the form. But as I said, in this version I, I shorted up the, the lyrics parts because that would take too long without lyrics. So listen to the original track and to, to point out how long the lyric parts are, I think they're double as long as they are here. But uh, just to get through the entire thing now, so... Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's get to the start and go through the entire song. To entry riff. Now the lyric part, uh, which is double as long as here. So now the singing would start. Something like this. They have four more come, but now we go direct to the refrain. Now comes a longer singing part. Uh, I don't remember the lyrics. Now comes this part with the chords with a D minor C start. Up the riff, uh, short one, three times. Short one. Now comes the main riff. Bridge, 
Now comes the second race. Schautöffel. Da kommt die Guitar Solo. Wenn ihr das Guitar Solo machen wollt, wird es auf D Minor sein. It's always on D. Yeah, that was not a tutorial. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I know there's a last part, but I skipped that one uh, because the song is basically like over 10 minutes. I thought the first part would be cool. Uh, the last part is just speeding up the entire thing in a long guitar solo. Also, the guitar solo in the first part can be extended very much uh, as a live version, as the singing parts uh, also can be extended. If you want to download the backing track, there are now three possibilities. Uh, Patreon, there's a link added in the description on my download page and I have a new member area on my main page hanspetekruzi.com I'm going to build up a community there but that is about all my musical work and not only HP Crazy but if you love what I'm doing uh, it's free yeah uh, you can follow me on Facebook if you love what I'm doing make a donation because Dr. Pink is hungry me too today I only had salad wow no burger <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, and uh, what else? Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Yeah, follow me on Facebook, on Spotify as well, and because there you also get announced when I do some live shows currently in Switzerland. Yeah, that's Dr. Ping, if something more to say. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> 